also telling me that you're not that you're no longer supporting my friends because they don't watch G5 or enjoy G5 anymore. Uh, good for you. Yeah, I'm just gonna. What what makes you think I care that you're not supporting them anymore? Other than you're letting me know that you're being rude. Good job. And just if anything, like. I think I should put it like this. I actually enjoy G5, but I know that there's a lot of us who hate G5 with a passion, obviously. But does that deteriorate our friendship? No. 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 Everybody's got different opinions on things. That's... that's no. Go ahead. I was just going to say I don't like how they release the episodes or, or seasons in these, like, uh, specials and stuff yeah, like that. Yeah, Netflix is weird it. like that. Oh, yeah. shit. Nice save! Nice! Oh, Thank you. oh, you got it, you got it, you got it! The fucking camera! Ah, oh you got it! Oh my nice save. fucking god. Alright. Alright, Penguin, come on. Yeah, any year now, well, I'm still young. <laughs> Watch, he died. Oh, that would suck if he didn't show up. Magic, seeing Father Mayonnaise. Have you ever heard of a Halloween movie called Scary Godmother? It was my favorite Halloween movie next to Twitch's growing up. I oh, Scary Godmother! I unironically like it. Like yeah. that show. I've seen it, and I've seen its sequel. I don't know what it is, but I like it. I don't know why. It, it's charming. It has heart, even if the even if the animation. I guess I had to. Well, I guess yeah. I had to do this a second time. Wonderful. I mean, you have, yeah. like, uh, what's his name? Gary Chalk as one of the monsters. It's Optimus Prime from the fucking Unicron trilogy. Yeah. I, I don't know why I like it so much. Maybe it is because of the writing and the voice acting, because <laughs> the animation is atrocious. <laughs> the skeleton in the closet who talks with a gay lisp. I love it! <laughs> the moochie werewolf. The vampire family. Hey, yeah. Retro. Go, um... Joker, you can say something, just be careful what you say. Yeah, because no! like I said, I am not against anybody who likes what they like. If, if they like it or not, I'm not going to pass judgment on them for having an opinion. Just don't tell me that ah, I'm no longer supporting your friends. I'm no longer supporting you because you don't like G5. You know, the best thing is, like, when you? I, there's people who made videos, like, saying how much they hate G5. You know what I do? I don't watch them. I just... Find something else. Fine if you don't want to watch us, but you don't have to go on, go out of your way to tell us either, because that just tells me you're entitled. Because yeah, you... if you're expecting us to care that you're not going to watch us, then no, it just means you're no longer <laughs> interested, and you're only telling us because you want to be a jerk. <laughs> you don't have to be a jerk. Jesus. And no. me not liking stuff doesn't make me a jerk, and you liking stuff doesn't make you a jerk. No, it's Damn just it. a difference of opinion. I mean, it's not like, you know what? I'm not even gonna go that far. I mean, look, look. Here's a better. Here's a good example. I love aliens. Oh yeah. I love Damn aliens. Oh, I also I like Alien. And you know what? Despite its flaws, and yes, I'm aware it does, I do like Alien 3. A oh. lot of people in the fandom of Aliens does not. And I understand why. It ticks a shit do on I... the ending of Aliens. It, it really does. Lars, by far, doesn't like Alien 3 either, but he will tolerate that before he tolerates Alien Resurrection. <laughs> Rusty Helm 93 is now following. Thank you for that. Well, Bianca is not a good character. I'll still love her because she's cute. She's a cute bun, and I'm a sucker for cute bun buns. However, I also <laughs> like Alora. And that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. What about Hunter? Hunter's cool. He's a bro. I like him. <laughs> a little cowardly cheetah. <laughs> he can be a little cowardly, but he has his uh, heroic moments, too. Oh, yeah. I love his relationship with Bianca. Yeah. Up and fire! God damn it, that's oh. twice. Alright. I guess I'm not gonna bother with this one. 
Bless you. Thank you. Yeah. Eliora doesn't like horror, and she doesn't like sci-fi horror. I will admit I made the mistake of getting on her case about that, though I did kind of say it in jest. Yeah, I think uh, this was when ta uh, talking about when she said she didn't watch T <coughs> two or the Alien movies. Yeah, no, I, I admit I got on her case a little bit, but it was to be it was <laughs> mostly just to be over dramatic. But yeah, I, I realized then and there that she kind of took that not not in a funny way, and I realized that I made an error in judgment, and I apologized because it's okay not to like horror or sci fi horror. There's nothing wrong with that. You know, the thing that always irritates me whenever it comes to, not so much as opinions, but more so that some people will, you know, have a different opinion on something, but then they go the extra mile and use the objective word. Like, Ugh. yeah, like, th like, The Last Jedi is an objectively poorly made film. No, like, some people have legit reasons for liking it. Is it a crime? I mean, personally, I can't... I'm not going to Nothing you say will convince me that it's a good movie, but I will respect that if you like it, you like it. Yeah, but if you say it's an objectively poorly made film, that means there's no valid reasons to ever enjoy it unless you refer to it as some kind of guilty pleasure, which is not a very fair way to go about it, because it just prevents people from having their own thoughts, you know, their own free will to think outside of the box. Yeah. Tremors and the... Yes, I watched Tremors, the first one. Oh, I love the Tremors series. Second one is really good too. I I enjoy the third one for what it is, even if I don't like the name of them. Ass blast. What was it? Ass, Ass blast. <laughs> yeah. But the Bert. third one is okay. The second one's good. The first one is great. Uh, though I'll argue the second one's pretty great too. Oh yeah, I love the second one. So yeah. many memorable moments. I feel there was critical need to need know, to know information. information. <laughs> well, I haven't seen the second one. I do love the moment where, um, what was it? There's two people, uh, one of them was Reba McIntyre, and they were just blasting oh. away in the gun room. They just broke the rock! Bert, yep. That's Bert and his wife. Yeah. No, go ahead. We should make that a movie night to watch the second movie. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sure. I would love that. <laughs> God damn it. Okay. No. Uh, no, go. I do not support AI-generated images unless it's no. for to help with references, at the very least, but to call it, I made this artwork and it was AI-generated, uh, no. No, you didn't. You just had something do it for you, and it's referencing, like, different kinds of artwork and different styles to combine to its own. You're stealing other people's work doing that. That's like me giving Bliss a bunch of information for a picture, and then she makes a picture and me claiming it as my own art. Yeah, no. Yeah. That's literally what that is. Look, AI is a tool. I will admit there are some useful things about it that are probably beneficial, but not for the ways that could hurt other people, especially me? in the work industry. Especially for voice actors, that's been scary. That's been a scary situation. Yeah. But let's not go into that. That's a that's a deep topic. Yeah, like as is, like there've already been a couple of topics here that I've been a little nervous before they would get out of hand. There is actually some hope on that. I did hear that there was some legislation passed because of the whole actually because of the whole Kendrick versus Drake beef. Oh my because, god. <laughs> because Drake used Tupac's voice in an <gasps> AI fashion without permission from uh, his uh, family uh, uh, oh, so uh, yeah no uh, uh, oh. i am not cool with that yeah Drake uh, was, would turn it uh, yeah. fucking gray that's horrible that's what kendrick said <laughs> yeah no i yeah, the, yeah that's what kendrick said and who was the other one drake yeah drake burning hell mm. um all right david if you're gonna ask the question then i'm gonna be honest uh, using AI to improve on your artwork? Yeah, I, I frown upon that because you're not improving. You're letting a computer improve. No, not a computer. You're letting a software improve it for you. There go, you're not improving yourself. Yeah, like, how are you, like, what kind of techniques are you developing with, uh, like, an AI image of some sort? I. You don't get better if you let a software do it for you. Like, I could see AI being used to point out with some imperfections that you could improve on in a piece, like, I don't yeah. know, but like, 
but like completely doing it for you, I don't know. Eh. Yeah. This can somewhat be like, this can even be set for voice actors because there's been a handful of channels that were using AI voices. But whenever I've seen the AI voices be used, they're very, very goofy to the point where it's like, I don't think you would want to hire a voice actor to voice something that looks like a fever dream of an idea. Like the amount of like, uh, various like ripoffs of digital circus channels popping up all over YouTube now. Oh, I've heard about that. That was disgusting. The content I'm getting farms. Called. Hang on a second. Yeah, no worries. Like I said, AI is a tool, and when used appropriately, it, it can be a good tool. But if you abuse this tool, well, then we have a problem. Yep. I like I like the redesigns and the, the the toys for Bob reversion. I also like Spyro's redesign. I I like he's a <laughs> Riley. Can I just say it? He's thick. <laughs> Anyways, back to what I was saying earlier. Like yeah. So obviously I, I I take a bit of joy watching the silly like AI president voices and such because the way they bounce off each other, mostly with political jokes and all that shit. But yeah. <laughs> Like, there was an argument said that you could get actual voice actors to sound like the presidents and such, but at the same time, it's like, you want to get actual voice actors to professionally voice the presidents over something as silly like them playing a video game. I think part of the joke is, like, the stiffness from the AI voices, honestly. There is something hilarious about that. Hey, Vlad, haven't heard yeah. from you in a while. <gasps> hey, Vlad! AI is Bloody best, daddy! All other opinions are cringe. Sorry, I had to be the contrarian asshole. What are oh, we talking about? Quiet, dude. Uh, Brandon, uh, we first earlier were talking about AI oh, art and whether or not it's art. No, it's thieving. Okay, there we go. I, I fixed it. Hey, logic. I, I would've... Let me guess, Blitz. You had uh, you, you had my you had my fucking volume turned down, didn't you? I did because you uh -huh. were like, yeah. the last time you were calling. <laughs> you were super duper loud. My bad. Don't worry, I I I've improved. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> no, <laughs> you're fine. Don't run away, Flam. We, we miss you. We love it when you're around. Yeah, no. Oh, you think I'm gonna run away? Get fucked. <laughs> 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 okay, I um. Hi, Logic. Hey, hey Cavatina. I just. Go ahead. <laughs> I j So, um. <laughs> it took me a moment to notice, but, um. That's Super Mario. And yeah. also, a thematically unrelated Remington shotgun. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, he's going hunting for apes in the underbrush of Africa. <laughs> <laughs> Brian Blessed has given his approval for this video game. I don't know what the problem is. <laughs> but yeah, Golden, when you stepped out, I was asking Riley, Riley, can I just be honest with the re reboot, not the reboot, the redo of the Spiral Trilogy? Spiral be thick and I love it. <laughs> you guys oh, should die. And he's so cat-like too. I, I like love it. it. 